Hi, my name is Wyatt Thomas, and I'm currently a sophomore at Grand Canyon University. I'm seeking to have a position at any startup company for my future to one day hopefully gain enough experience to open up my own company. And for my unique selling proposition, I would like to go over three different categories. Uniqueness, value, and proposition. Since I uh, want to express why I'm unique, I believe that one of my most unique qualities I have is my growth mindset, which is something that I've had to develop over years of um, tough times and many obstacles throughout my life. And it helped me to overcome losing 100 pounds, to getting enough scholarships to uh, financially prepare myself for Grand Canyon University and make it out to college on my own. Um, also for other situations and circumstances I can't think of right now, but I believe that this is a huge advantage um, because it makes me unique, because it's something I've had to learn on my own, and it's something that has come from a me versus me mentality, which is moving on to my value. And I believe I would be a great value to a, any startup company as an employee, because I have a me versus me mentality. It's my biggest strength and it's also my biggest weakness. Um, not something like public speaking or getting along with others. I always put the blame on myself, which, like I said, can be my greatest strength and it's also my greatest weakness. But if I didn't have that mentality, I never would have developed my growth mindset, which is something that top performers in every category in all sorts of businesses, like from Tom Bilyeu to Elon Musk to Bill Gates to Steve Jobs, they all have what's called the growth mindset, which is where you can objectively look at a mistake and take a risk and even have enough risk to even take a, or have enough courage to take a risk in the, to begin with. And if it doesn't work out, you can look at it objectively, ask yourself, how did it go wrong? And how can I improve upon it next time instead of something like a fixed mindset where a failure determines who you are. And if I didn't have a me versus me mentality, I would never have developed that growth mindset. And I believe that if I'm hired on, that this is something I can implement within the workspace, uh, and it could be used to accomplish major tasks, like increasing sales revenue by another million dollars if it's for a major corporation, or for getting generating more ad leads, and I believe that having this mindset is um, just invaluable for any new employee, especially in a startup where you can grow into any position. And lastly, my proposition, which is something that I can consistently deliver to the company, I believe that that also stems from my me versus me. I don't have an exact reference point of when I first developed that mindset. I've always kind of taken things and blamed them on myself, which through the early stages of my life was something that was considered negative, but it's something that I've consistently had, and now I look at it as a blessing because it's something that's always consistently there throughout all my experiences is a me versus me, how can I get better? And now that I'm developing the growth mindset instead of a fixed mindset, when I'm doing a me versus me, I can ask myself how I can improve upon my mistakes. And I believe that that would have um, caused me to, it would have been probably the most important part of me losing 100 pounds, which is something I'm very proud of, Graduate, graduating top 10 of my high school, um, earning enough scholarships to make it to Grand Canyon University, and earning my various awards. Um, but I believe that those are the values, and I believe why I would be a good consideration for hire for a startup company and yeah thank you